In this video, I'm going to show you how you guys can fix ChatGPT XSD in an error code 1020. In order to fix the problem, you have to follow the tutorial from starting to end. You just have to follow the tutorial without skipping it. So our first step is to clear is the inside data of OpenAI. So to do that, so open up a browser in which you're using ChatGPT and click on three dot here, then go to setting. I'm using Chrome. If you're using Chrome, then this will work for you. So go to privacy and security, then go to cookies and other side data, then click on see all cookies and side data. Then here search for OpenAI. As you can see, OpenAI, these three cookies are available right over here. Then I'm going to delete all of them. Now this is the first step. Now let's move on to the next step. That is disabling all the extensions installed in our browser. To disable the extensions, I have to click on this three dot here and click on more tools and click extensions right over here. Now here you will see all the installed extensions in your browser. So there are two extensions installed in my browser. So I'm going to turn off all of them. So that is the second step. Now let's move on to the next step. Third step is installing our VPN. So we're going to install a VPN in our browser. Install the VPN we're going to use Chrome Web Store. Search for Chrome Web Store. Then open the first website chrome.google.com slash web store. And here you can search any VPN that you want to for today. I'm gonna use Touch VPN. That just works perfect for me. Touch VPN. I would like to install this one. Then I'm gonna click on Add to Chrome. Click Add Extension right over here. Then I have to click on this extension icon here. Then click on Touch VPN. Then I have to click on Path Choice, and then you have to select United States from here. Then click on Connect. Now this is the third step. That is installing a VPN in our browser. I have to go into your chat GPT and then check your chat GPT, chat GPT is working or not. If chat GPT is not working, then you have to follow the fourth step. Changing your IP address in your DNS server. Now the third step is to changing your IP address in your DNS server in your network. But to do that, we are going to CMD. Let's launch a CMD as administrator. Right click on it. Select one as administrator. Click yes. And you have to type the following commands. First, you have to type ipconfig space slash release. And once you're done, you have to type ipconfig space slash renew. But it can take a little bit of time. Process it. Now once you're done, then you have to type the last command that is ipconfig space slash plus DNS. Now once you plus the DNS, then you have to close the CMD. Then you have to open control panel. And here, make sure large icon is selected. And you have to click on network and settings sharing center and here you will find your connections if it is showing wi-fi click on wi-fi if it is showing internet though so i'm gonna click on internet and here i'm gonna click on properties then double click on internet protocol version 4 tcp ip4 then we are going to put google dns server right over here the following dns server addresses and type preferred dns server 8 8 8 and 8 8 8 4 and 4 that is the google dns server we are going to use click ok here click ok close then close it and we are all done so that is the fourth step now let's move on to the fifth step that is changing our browser instead of chrome you can use firefox opera or edge you can install any browser that is perfectly working for you you have to do experiment that by disabling chat gpt is working you should do it let me just close stop the VPN and let me just try again ChatGPT is working. If ChatGPT is working with VPN then you have to try with the VPN. If ChatGPT is not working with the VPN then you have to uninstall the VPN. After applying all the 5 steps then you will be able to access your ChatGPT without any error. So hope you guys found this quick video helpful make sure to hit the like button and also subscribe and channel. thanks for watching.